Are there any GRC certifications that you recommend? I saw that you don't have any in the field. So GRC stands for governance, risk, and compliance, if I'm not mistaken. There's a lot of different career paths that tie into GRC. There are purely document jobs that are focused on compliance. That's like what I do, risk management framework type jobs. So that actually would be risk. You've got risk-based jobs, but then there's compliance jobs where you all you do is documentation and compliance. Then there's overlap. There's people who do both. They do risk analysis, risk assessments, and then they do compliance, like where they're actually doing the documentation and making sure it's in compliance with ISO 27001 or PCI compliance or whatever, right? So those are overlapping jobs. Those are both within the sphere of GRC because you've got governance, you've got risk, and you've got compliance. And let me make sure I'm not lying to you guys. I don't want to get this wrong. So when you're talking governance, you're talking about audits, you're talking about control activities, you're talking about uh, strategy management. These things right Right here are all individually be jobs. You could have auditors in the IRS. You could have auditors in aerospace, in Department of Defense, you name it, right? All kinds of auditors. That in and of itself is a whole career path. You got business processes. This is people who do things like disaster recovery, right? To make sure that the business continuity is in place. You got people who are making sure the business processes are going, your managers. And then you've got ISOs, like information system security officers. They're doing work where they're making sure sure that the system is within compliance with NIST 853 or whatever framework they're using. Then you got risk management, risk assessments, making sure that the systems that are in place, the whole infrastructure doesn't have a certain level of risk or has a certain level of risk. So there's many different jobs. When you say GRC, that's a very broad term. Normally, if you want to specify a job, you have the job description, you have the job title, you have the role and the tasks that are involved with that. GRC is a very huge term. Are there any GRC certifications. There are certifications that fall into this. There's C-RISC, which is from ISACA. You've got ISC2 CAP. That one focuses on NIST 853, 850, 37, and um, the FIPS compliance. You've got, I believe SANS has a course that focuses on this. And if I'm not mistaken, CompTIA might have one. All of those focused on some aspect of risk or compliance normally, and then some governance. And then actually in some of the domains, like in the CISSP has domains that talk about risk and compliance and auditing and control activities. So this, it covers a lot of this ground. Probably the certifications I would say that, that are more GRC related, probably the, the CAP. Let me just show you what that looks like. This one right here is a certification that if you were, if you wanted a certification that's very soundly within GRC, then this would be one of them. ISACA has one called C-RISC and then there's one called CISA. Both of those also kind of fall into this realm of GRC. There's one right here, certified in governance and enterprise IT. There you go. There's another one.